Hi, I'm Bobby Ola. I'm with BobbyOla.com and HittingAnswers.com. Uh, I'm a hitting improvement coach. I'm here today to show you ways of increasing your bat speed, your rotational power, how to hit a ball harder, how to hit a ball farther. My background is I played in the New York Met organization six years. I played super major slow pitch softball and I also played for Michael Bolton's Bolton Bombers for about eight or nine years. And what we used to do was we used to go around to all the major league and minor league stadiums, hit softballs over the baseball field fences. Baseball field fences around 350 to 400 where softball is regulation is 300. So I had to learn how to increase power and bat speed to get the ball through a bigger infield and hit a ball over a longer, farther fence. Uh, today's lesson will be on warming up. I do believe that before you even step into a batting cage or on a field to take batting practice, you have to be properly warmed up. Uh, the best way to do it is by actually taking a wiffle ball bat and just getting the blood flow back in. Something light. It doesn't have to be your game bat. I always take about maybe 20, 25 warm-up swings with a wiffle ball bat. And each swing becomes increasingly faster. Starts to get the flow of the hitting muscles loose, it gets the joints loose and everything. But this is what I usually use too, just to uh, try to increase a little bit more speed. It's called overspeed training. Also, what I also do is, I usually take a weighted bat. Now a weighted bat, there's a lot of argument on that. But what I do is I just stretch with it, okay? I never really swing with a weighted bat. I may just do something, just a, like a nice little follow through, but it's just to loosen up. You don't go up there and you swing as hard as you can to try to increase any type of speed because what you're doing is you're activating some slow, tw uh, slow twitch muscles. But between the wiffle ball bat of the first initial swing is the best. And then just stretching with a weighted bat really helps you get loose. Just before you step into a batting cage or on uh, a field where there's batting practice. After you've done both of those, you just grab your regular bat. I would always say too, you know what, maybe a little bit of soft toss, a little bit of uh, hitting off a batting tee before the, the initial batting practice anywhere. So if you need any more information, please go to bobbyola.com or hittinganswers.com. And thanks for watching.